Hi, this is Galit Goldfarb and welcome to my Gorilla Life Coaching videos. Five times a week, I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier and happier place for you and I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. So how are you doing today? I hope everything is wonderful for you and that you're safe. And today, our quote of the day is all about asking. And it goes, asking for help isn't a sign of weakness. It's a sign of strength. It shows that you have the courage to admit when you don't know something and to learn something new by Barack Obama. How many of us are one request away from what we really want? Well, you will never know until you ask. So many of us have a problem of asking for help or for asking for what we need from those who can really give it to us. Most people do not like to ask for help because they feel that it asking lowers them. It makes them look too needy and perhaps even incapable. But in fact, no one has reached greatness without the help of others. It is those people who ask for what they need who are often the only ones who will get it. You must learn how to ask for what you want and learn to overcome feeling timid or fear of rejection. It is very natural to feel feelings of rejection. We as a species know that it was for our best interest to belong to a group for our survival. Therefore, we, are always, we always want and need to be part of a group. And as I spoke in yesterday's video, this is the first phase of life that we go through. It is so important. We learn from a very young age of how to best belong to a group. Being rejected by someone is not easy for any of us. But if you do not take risks, you will not be able to uh, get closer to your goals and you certainly will not be in a better place than you are now. You must do something different. And often, the different thing that you need to do is that you didn't do beforehand is to ask from someone who can give it to you. If you fear rejection so much that you choose not to ask then you will never improve your situation. You will remain in the same place where that situation is concerned. You must overcome the strong fear of rejection and ask for what you desire. And I tell you that the more you do it, the better at it you will become. You will start asking for the things you need much more easily. And this will increase your self-esteem and dramatically increase your chances of success. I remember when I first asked for a loan from a family member. I needed some help to buy an apartment that was a really great deal. I needed to buy it fast and I needed only a small loan for about a year until I would sell a smaller property that I had on sale. I had never asked for anyone for money before. And I had asked, of course, from the bank for money, but never from somebody that I knew. I remember sitting with that person for lunch and thinking about the Nike ad. Just do it just do it and saying this to myself a few times until I finally found the courage to blurt out what I really needed. And to my surprise, the answer was yes. I did not, I did not expect a yes. I wanted a yes and, and I was hoping for a yes, but I was still open to whatever the situation would provide. And um, you will never know until you try to ask for what you need, you will never know the answer. And if you don't ask, you are actually rejecting yourself before you've even given the other person a chance to say what they really do want to do. Successfully, people ask confidently. They ask without fear. And if the answer is yes, then wonderful. And if the answer is no, then they are anyway in the same place that they were before they asked. But at least they tried. Now, there is one thing that is of utmost importance when asking for something you need from someone. You have to know and ask for exactly what you want. You must be specific. If you ask someone out on a date, don't just ask if they want to go out with you. Instead, ask if they want to go out for lunch on Sunday at 2 p.m. <laughs> if you ask for money, don't just say that you need some help. Ask for a specific sum of money and when you need it and for what you need it and when you will pay it back. Be specific. Give all the details. Sometimes when you can't get what you want from or need from one person, then you can try and ask someone else or even try the same person again at a later date. 
Now you may think of a better way to get what you want instead of asking the person, uh, asking a different person. You you can think out of the box, and sometimes you will have a different solution. But often you really have to have no other way about it, and you have to ask someone for what you need. In such circumstances, don't hesitate asking again and again. Don't give up on your dreams. You see this all the time with children. They never give up on what they really want. In fact, they become more and more adamant the more they ask. And what usually happens, we all know, they usually get what they want, right? <laughs> Sometimes when you ask for something, the timing may not be right, or the other person cannot do it this time, but they may be open to your request the next time if you choose to ask again. Things can change. Your relationship with that person can change and become more a trusting relationship. Even a person's mood may change enough to make them say yes the next time. Asking can certainly be very, very uncomfortable. I know it. But the more you do it, the more you ask, the more comfortable and confident you will become. You will improve every single time that you ask for something that is important for you. You must persevere on the path to your goals. And at times, you will need to ask for other people for something. Do it in a friendly manner, with a smile, and you will never regret trying. And in the end, if you persevere, chances are that you will get what, it, what you need. Statistically, if you keep trying, you will eventually get a yes as an answer. Asking doesn't necessarily need to be for something physical as well. Sometimes you just want to know something, then you will ask to, to understand better. Instead of making assumptions, you can just ask and get your questions answered. Asking will always get you one step closer to where you desire to be. And this is so, so important in reaching all of your goals. So, as I always do with these videos, I will provide you with a question that you want to ask yourself so that the answer can help you move your life to a better place for you. And the question of the day is, is there something that I need to ask from someone in order to get me closer to my goals? And, and then you can ask yourself, why have I not asked until now? And what can happen if I do ask for what I want? And also ask yourself if you can live with a rejection. If I get no as an answer, will I be able to live with it? For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. So think to yourself, what is the price I will have to pay for not asking? As usual, I recommend writing your, these questions and your answers in a notebook that you have especially prepared for these coaching sessions so that you can look over them and make sure that you are headed in the right direction for the best life the ideal life for you. So to finish off, the affirmation of the day is, I have the courage to ask for what I want and need. I have the courage to ask for what I want and need. Now tell this to yourself as many times as you remember to do so today because an affirmation has the power to completely transform your life the more you repeat it the more it enters your subconscious mind. So thank you very much for joining me here today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to my channel and ring the notifications button for notifications every time I upload a new video. And please also visit my website, thegorilladiet.com, for anything to help you move your health and wellness to a place that you deserve and desire. Thank you very much.